Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use AnyDesk. Now, AnyDesk is a free software that can be used to remotely access another computer over the public internet, very similar to TeamViewer. So if for some reason you cannot get the TeamViewer working for you, AnyDesk is an alternative. Uh, obviously, just like TeamViewer, AnyDesk comes with a free version as well as a business or a paid version. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the free version. So double click on your web browser. First of all, we're going to go and download AnyDesk. So search for AnyDesk, all one word, and click on AnyDesk. This is the official link to AnyDesk website anydesk.com and click on download now button in here it will give you a few options depending on your operating system you can select which one to download it will detect automatically which operating system that you're using and it will download the um, relevant setup file so it's been downloaded to my machine so I'm just gonna click on the downloaded file and this will open up any desk. Now, this is your address, which you have to give to the other person who's trying to connect to your machine. So now I'm going to pretend to be the outsider who's going to connect. So I'm just going to go ahead and do the exact same thing on my host computer. I'm going to run any desk now, and then I'm going to try to connect to this computer over here so it'll show you how it's going to look so this is my host computer so what I'm going to do is I'm going to enter the remote address on my remote computer 94 94305384 and I'm going to hit enter and I'm just going to click allow so this is the first time that I'm using AnyDesk on my host computer. So that was the firewall asking if I want to allow network traffic for this application, which I have selected yes. So let me just move this window over there. Now, if you're the person who's receiving this remote assistance, you will get a prompt like this, which will um, tell you if you want to accept or dismiss. So I'm going to click accept. And I'm going to click yes to the remote um, prompt. And then you can also enable this application, AnyDesk, on private networks as well. So just tick this and click allow access. So this will make sure that the person, the remote person, has got access to your computer. And you will be able to control the remote computer using AnyDesk. Thank you very much for your attention. If you like this video, please just give this video a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber to my channel, please consider subscribing. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you and have a good day.